Hello and welcome. Today we have uh, Dr. Kirtivan Vashist, one of the very high scorer in USML Step 1 and a PGY1 medical resident uh, in America. And today we'll be asking and talking to him about his clinical research experience and how it was helpful for his residency application. So thank you, Dr. Vashist, for being with us today. Would you mind sharing uh, briefly uh, about how your clinical experience or clinical research experience in America was helpful for your residency application? Uh, thank you, Dr. Kashyap, uh, for introducing me. I'm Kirti Vadan Vashesh, and I worked uh, for a while in one of the premium leading institutions uh, in America as a clinical uh, researcher um, before joining in residency. And I really feel it helps uh, shape your application in such a way, which not only helps your residency, but also if you're thinking about future fellowships, then that as well. Um, so... Uh, this clinical, the, the the program, the institution I was working in, it not only provided me with uh, the research opportunities, it also exposed me to a lot of faculties, a lot of uh, um, the residents and uh, the fellows who I could build connections with, the meaningful professional collection, uh, connections and help them. Uh, they would usually just help me and with a lot of personal advices as well as professional advices. Um, I was exposed to multinational uh, clinical trials, um, uh, case reports, and multitudes of different uh, uh, different uh, research literature as well. Um, this not only helps you prepare for uh, the kind of the kind of residency a lot of institutions are looking for, which means that they're looking for residents who are actively involved in research and not just clinical medicine, but also help you approach towards fellowship to begin with. But let's say if, you're, if you really are interested in pulmonary critical care and you want to in future apply for it, then if you start working towards uh, creating some sort of a profile towards it to begin with uh, before your residency, then uh, having some abstracts, some case, the case presentations and uh, some uh, manuscripts uh, before joining in residency really helps you uh, with your residency as well as your fellowships. Um, in the end, also when uh, you're applying for uh, the residency, when the program director interviews you, um, majority of the times when I was getting interviewed, we had very thorough discussions about the research I was involved in and uh, program directors specifically emphasizes on the letters of recommendations given from the faculties of the institutes we have worked in and i think that really helps because that is a very personalized as well as a very strong letter of recommendation that again depending on how well you have worked with the mentor and that helps you achieve your goals in the long run. well uh, 